Hey guys, Clone Guy here, and uh, are you guys ready for some tanking? Because I am. Today, we're playing Tigers. Nothing but Tigers. We have five different Tigers in our garage. We'll be playing all of them. And there are... There are a few more Tigers that we don't have. Right. We've got the Citadel and the Heavy Tank number six. But I think those are pretty much the Tiger 217. Except the Citadel, I think, has a little bit more armor. And because of that, it's a little bit slower. Other than that, I'm pretty sure the Heavy Tank number six and Citadel are exactly the same as the Tiger 217. And then we also have the Tiger 131, which is very different from the other Tigers. The Tiger 1, which is, of course, the original Tiger. The Hammer, which is arguably the same as the Tiger, except it's got a nerf engine. But I think a more accurate gun and more hit points. And then the Russian Tiger, which is the T6100, which is also very different from the other Tigers in its own Russian way. So it's pretty cool. So all of these are very much different. Other than maybe the Tiger and the Hammer, you can kind of argue those being the same. Even though they are slightly different, but they play exactly the same. So, anyway... Um, yeah, here we go. I think, I think, well, okay, we'll start at tier 6, but I think if there are, is a group of tanks in this game that are all the same, but different, um, I think my second favorite would be the Tigers, and I think my favorite are the Centurions. I love it when they come out with a new Centurion, and, like, I, I just like them all. The Centurion 5.1, I can't wait for that thing to come out. Will I buy it? Probably not, uh, but I can't wait for it, for sure. I'm excited about the, that. Uh, the Atomic... The Primo Victoria, the regular Centurion, the Centurion 7-1, the Centurion Action X. I just like the Centurions. And then I think followed closely are the are the Tigers. I love the Tigers. And if they release, like, a new Tiger, oh, man, I might buy it. Like, an American Tiger or something like that. Did we ever capture any? I don't know. I'm not a history buff. But I like those. I think that's cool. But we're starting off at Tier 6. Let me move my mic a little. Might squeak a little. There we go. And the thing about Tier 6 is uh, it has plus 2, minus 1 matchmaking. So you're going to get into games where you're... Well, you see this a lot. Okay, they're not top tier much at tier 6 anymore. Uh, so, But we'll do what we can here. We shall do what we can in our Tiger 217. Yeah, we're very much uh, underpowered. The tier 6, though, the armor works a lot better tier for tier. I just wish the matchmaking wasn't so bad for tier 6 right now. It'd be great. If the matchmaking was normal, this tank would be a, a pretty powerful vehicle. It really would, because then you can fight 4s and 5s more often instead of fighting nothing but sevens and eights which renders your armor useless and and you're this is also the slowest of the tigers because it only has a 650 horsepower engine the hammer and the tiger or the t6100 have a 700 horsepower en engine and the uh tiger one and the tiger one three one all have the original 870 engine, which I know isn't historically accurate, but uh, who cares? It, I, the tank actually performs well. They gave it the historically accurate engine on PC, and now it's bad. <laughs> it's slow. It is slow tank. But hey, but hey, right? Okay. Do we try to fight an Edelweiss? Perhaps. How about an Undertaker? I don't think we can pen that guy. Oh wait, we can pen his lower plate probably. In fact, his Coppola at this angle is probably the best bet. Nice. Fantastic start. The Edelweiss is there now. I don't know how to pen an Edelweiss with this gun. We could probably pen him in the lower plate, but we have a 5100 who's emptying his magazine into a tank that apparently doesn't want to move. Hmm. That's a good player. I really want the Edelweiss too. <laughs> That's another one that I just I would love. To just have. Easy. Uh oh, watch out, guys. It's a tier 6 light tank. Oh, he's dead. Undertaker Freedom. Mmm, that's not what I wanted to fight, it's a Freedom. That's an unfortunate shot there. That makes up for it, though. Ow! We have a better rate of fire than this guy. We should have a better rate of fire than this guy. Yep. There we go. Oh, no! My friend died! Oh, but my 5120 is here! Our 5100 is here. Nice weak spot. Woo! 
I'm scared for my life as I'm now a one shot for the ISU. Or the SU. This is an SU somewhere. Huh. He's probably in the back. And there's a Hellcat as well. So is it. Should I go after this hammer? Probably not. I think I'll be dead. I think I made a, a bit of a misplay. Let's load HE. Because that's either the Hellcat or the SU. And then either way, the next tank we're going to see is going to be the Hellcat. Or the SU, yeah. There we go. Plus we were targeted, so maybe it was the Hellcat who had us targeted. There he is. Oh, we don't actually have a shot on him. Oh, he stopped. How dare he. And now he's dead. He got already. Well done, sir. Yeah, we if we had gone straight this way, we probably would have been able to shoot the Hellcat. Now, now there's the big question. Do I want to drop down or do I want to stay in snipe? I'm going to drop down just in case he's on my left. And look at that. We've spotted him, so we should get the assist for this. Which I kind of need, so it's all good. Huh. Couldn't quite find the shot. <laughs> but it doesn't matter. We get the assist, which, I, like I said, was a bit more important for the contract I'm, I'm on. I need a bit more assist to get it done, but I should get it done uh, playing these tanks today. Uh, there we go. First class, apparently. But we were fighting eights, and most of the damage we did were to eights. In fact, the only damage we did were to, the, to these two tier eights. So that's why we got so much experience there. I was, we were point-blank range, fighting fighting two tiers higher than us. So that's pretty cool. It's pretty cool indeed. All right. <clears throat> let's, uh, let's jump into the next tank, and the next one is going to be the Tiger 131, which is pretty disgusting it, it really is a tiger 131 has this ridiculous rate of fire and preferential max making eight degrees of gun depression the top engine it just scoots around and decimates everybody it ever fights and it can hold its own in a tier 8 battle and it used it doesn't it supposedly has this gun that you right here which is really good well, not really good, but it's okay for preferential matchmaking. 145 pen, which is the same gun that's on the Tiger 217, <clears throat> but it's buffed. So it has a 169 pen and 227 pen. And it has pref matchmaking and 10.91 rounds a minute. Which, <clears throat> on PC, you can actually get that rate of fire on the Tiger 1 if you throw on the top end, top turret with this smaller gun. Um, you can't do that here, unfortunately, because you have packages here. So you have to, uh, you have to, you have to, you have to use this gun on the stock turret. It's a little bit annoying. It's sad. It really is. But that's okay. <clears throat> I would rather use the, like maybe the, it would be fun to have like the historical gun on the, uh, on the historical turret, right? But that's okay. Oh, cool. Well, we'll use this crew and we'll throw in a new crew skill. Uh, let's see. These are the unowned ones. This is this is my E100 crew. Let's see. Preventive maybe. No. Oh wow, we don't have much left. This is a good crew. Okay, so now we've we've really got a choice. Designated target is always nice. Intuition is, you know, you know. uh huh, huh. I don't see really a reason for any of these. Uh huh. I mean, oh, this is this this is my E one hundred crew, which I do have. Uh, usually have uh, fire kits and. Fire extinguishers, and, and I don't have that in here. So perhaps we should uh, we should do that. I didn't realize because none of these actually have uh, fire extinguishers. So <laughs> that's a uh, that's a bit of shame. Let's go here. You guys are hearing pinging in the background. That's yeah. oops. Oh well. Uh, throwing this on because I've, I've I keep losing multiple crew members per per already strike. It's really annoying. So <laughs> so I'm just I'm just done. I'm using large from now on. Um, two things the large does is it makes it, it makes your crew less likely to get injured when they take a hit. And, of course, you can heal multiple crew members at once. So that's cool. We're going to be doing that. Plus, it's 50% off right now. Arctic region. Oh, we did. Finish the assist. Did we? No, that was different. What was I seeing before, then? Hmm. Well, we need to block 20,000 damage. Uh, that's not going to really happen in the Tigers, is it? <laughs> no, no, it won't. Well, what's great about this, though, is we will not be fighting tier 9s. And in fact, we might even be fighting tier 5s. Just imagine. Just imagine it. Oh my gosh, there are tier 5s. Oh, we gotta really think. 
We don't want to get ourselves killed. Uh, the, the right play to, be, to make would probably be to go here. However, in this kind of matchmaking, I really want to preserve my health. I want to make sure I don't just get myself dead, you know? So what I'm going to do instead is, hey, look at that. Hey, buddy. I was just in that thing. What I'm going to do instead is I'm going to go here, and I'm going to spot here. For any slow pokes who are going that way. There's a lot of heavies, so there's a lot of slow pokes. And uh, hopefully get some early shots there. And we're also pretty safe there. Artie can hit us, but, I mean, where can't Artie hit you? If you're not playing the game. Um, well, if you're playing the game, Artie can hit you, right? And if you're not playing the game, you're losing the game. So, we just have to hope he doesn't hit us. <laughs> I know, that's so dumb. That's that's the state of World Tanks right now, isn't it? You just, alright, well, I want to play the game and win. So I just have to hope Artie doesn't shoot at me. <laughs> ah, I'm playing the game properly. Well, guess I get Artie'd. I'm surprised that he, uh, he hit that end pendant. 177 roll. That's unfortunate because now he's not a one shot for us unless you roll really high. Welcome to plus two. He survives. We're going to move on. I don't want to get arted. And uh, maybe, maybe that was the wrong play to shoot at him. Because now I'm not going to catch anyone crossing, most likely. What the heck is that guy doing? Anyone crossing? Anyone at all? The answer is no. Never mind. There's always there's always somebody late. That's unfortunate. Oh, that's even more unfortunate. Engine fire. Okay. Already just fired. I heard him, so I'm gonna sit here just a bit longer. But yeah, that was that was the play I was talking about. There you go, 1,700 damage. Seventeen hundred damage. The heavy tank is coming this way. <laughs> There's the banana buster, which kind of, or the boulder, it kind of scares me because of its armor. It's a tougher one to take down. They have a, oh, it's the 87. I wonder if I can make this now. This might be way too premature and I might die. Hey, look at the bot. Look at him. Look at him. Look at the bot. There he is. He shot at me instead of the Grass Panther. He didn't want to shoot his impending doom. Pulverize them a bit with our DPM. Nice. That should help them. There we go. He's down. And Churchill kills him. I think he's still alive. 
That's unfortunate. We might be able to get back down here. It's going to be dangerous. Oh, no, we can't. We actually can't. You see where the people are shooting from? It's not going to happen. Did I just... I don't understand. I think I just tracked his other drive wheel. I think I just tracked his other drive wheel. Oh, that didn't even hit him. Is there someone else there? There we go. Boom. What's great about those things is you can just track them and damaging, damage them, which is what I'm doing now. <clears throat> it's rather unfortunate. There we go. Look at this rate of fire. It's disgusting. It truly is. SOS. <laughs> Easy. Is this the Black Prince left? He's probably healthy. He is. He's healthy. Ah, oh, but our 57 is going to just go nom 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 nom. But we should beat our own either. Okay, actually, if he turns around... His arm is going to be an issue. Yeah. He's doing a good job keeping the 57 Heavy from flanking him. Because he's put the water there. He's not going to drown himself, is he? Look, he's bouncing every shot. This guy's amazing. This guy's a beast. But now he's got a 5-4. Which is going to be a little bit annoying for him. Unless he gets his armor turned around again. But we're just going to roll in there and ram. Five seconds. That thing's got a ridiculous rate of fire, doesn't it? Here we come. Here we come to save the day. Break this ice. <laughs> there we go. That is the uh, Tiger 131. <clears throat> hey, hit 50 more shots. Woohoo. We did that. We did that. Cool. Uh, that's uh, an East Tinker. I'll take it. Hey, we're at 99. <clears throat> Maybe you should 100% it. But 100% doesn't mean anything. Uh, I don't know why people are obsessed with it. Uh, because if you think about it, if the average damage of a tank is 2,000, then that's 50%. That means 100% is 4,000. And that also means 95, which is 3 marks, is 3,800. It's only 200 more to get a, to get 100%. And, uh, yeah, that's, uh, yeah, that's, that's really... That's literally just a high roll and at tier 10. A couple extra high rolls or one extra tracking shot or one extra spotting shot or one ex extra shot of damage. So it's it doesn't really require any more skill to get 100% in this game. If you can 3 market tank, you can 100% the tank, just so you know. But there we go. That's uh, 2400 base XP. <laughs> Tiger 131, ladies and gentlemen, is in the house. That's the Tiger 131. Now we're going to move on. To move on to the classic. The good old, good old Tiger. The original Tiger. The Tiger 1. What you got for me, Tiger 1? What you got? 75% uh, crew is what it has for me. 75% crew. Uh, we situation awareness is done. Now we're training recon, but that's okay. Uh, Tiger 1, classic. Great gun. Uh, let's compare it real quick. This is not the gun. 2.7 seconds aim time, 0.34 accuracy. 0.33. So yeah, the Tiger Tiger Hammer has the better better gun for sure, just because of its uh, accuracy. But you have more mobility in this thing. So <clears throat> and and that mobility to me is sometimes uh, sometimes the big thing, sometimes the big deciding factor in in the Tigers. And I, I love the mobility. That's what makes the Tiger 131 so good. And, and and the rate of fire, of course. But you saw the gun derping a lot. But it's it's really is the mobility that I love about the Tiger 131. And, and you get the same thing here, the same kind of mobility. You also have more gun depression than the 131, though, which does help. And all these have 380 view range, except, I think, the tier 8 or the tier 6. I'm not sure what the tier 6 has. In fact, while we wait for this, let me uh, let me take a take a gander here. Battle.worldtanks.com. There we go. Their website is so slow. It's ridiculous. It's incredible. Tanks. I might be here for a year waiting. <laughs> 
Tier 8 we have to fight. Okay, that's cool. I, I didn't realize there's a timer on the top right. Has that always been there? I don't know. <clears throat> Tiger 217 has... It has 370 V range. <clears throat> Excuse me. Which is really good. So you can, you know, I have optics on all these things. I usually put optics on everything anyway. But yeah, there you go. 5.78 seconds with a 75% crew. Gun rammer and vents. I mean, you can put food on here. You can get a mastered crew. So this is this is fine. We may get spotted crossing here because this is these spawns are weird. We do not. Where is the enemy? None of them have gone for the banana thing. The inverted banana. I don't know. What do we do? I don't know. That guy got smacked. Like an SU in the back, so we definitely want to do don't don't want to go that way. So we will go this way, but it's just scary. ISM T29 Minute Man, it's scary stuff. The Tiger can obviously take any one of those tanks in a one on one. It's it's yeah, it can take any tier seven in a one on one, other than maybe the Tiger one three one. But you know, let's. Assuming you can pen them. And the ISM is going to be tough to pen. So I guess we'll just wait here. Turn around for those guys if we need to. Alright, this T29 is uh, clearly relentless. His name lives up to his name. Alright, let's push this guy then. Oh, do you have a Thunderbolt as your support? I'm not so sure you want to get hit by that guy. Because I know what you are. I could trade, actually win that one because of my health. Is that an... Uh, uh, okay, no. B both already fired at once. Ours and theirs. To the same location, about. Yeah, I'm not taking that hit, buddy. I'm just going to back out of this. Because if that guy's shooting heat, it's not going to go well for either of us. If he's shooting HG, I'll just... I'll lose a bit. That guy's rolled decently high on me twice now. <laughs> Where the S you go? <clears throat> Three health. Fired. Nice. Good plays, boys. Here we go. We got it. We got it. Hey, we damaged 15 vehicles. Yay. Wow, I'm actually going somewhere with this whole thing. What is it? Battle pass that you had to pay for and is harder than all the other battle passes they've had since the start of last year.
cool. <laughs> Yay. I mean, it's not like impossible, but for most people who don't spend four hours a day playing, it's going to be really hard for them. Like me. That's me. So I don't think I'm going to get the battle pass done, unfortunately, but hey, it is what it is. But we have two more tigers. Two more tigers to play. This is going to be a nice long video. I know people have been saying they've been enjoying the long video, so enjoy. Now we have the hammer, which is pretty much Tiger 1. Except slower, but a better gun-ish. Um, you're also going to notice my rate of fire is better, but that, is, again, is because I don't have a 75% crew in this. Okay. Okay. You also have 50 more health. Hey, 50. Woohoo. Uh, it'll, it'll, it'll... Which will help, because you have a lot of situations in this game. Um, not every game, but a few... A game from time to time where you're sitting there, and you have 250 health left, and you're fighting, let's say, a T20. A T20 has 240 alpha, but he can roll high enough to kill you if you have 250 health left. If you're in the hammer, you have 300 health left, and then you're like, hey, I can take this hit. Right? I can take this hit and kill this guy. So, it does come into play. Even 25 extra health will defeat, usually defeat that kind of situation, right? So, Abby, maybe we'll be top tier in our tiger. I see a scorpion. Ooh. Ooh, oh, to your right, that's fine, that's fine. Gun is more than capable of dealing with with the likes of tier. Um, tier 8. So, but this is an interesting, this is interesting. We have all, all the enemies' bottom tiers are PlayStation, but all of our top tiers are PlayStation. So this is going to be an interesting fight. Interesting fight. Where do we want to go? We want to go to the middle. 5.53 seconds of reload. That's really good. What the heck is Stone Cold? Is that the one with the two-shot auto-loader? I think so. Or you can use single-shot, but... Who's gonna use single-shot on that? Uh, probably a lot of people. <laughs> but if I ever get it, which I probably won't, I'm using the two-shot. For sure. For sure, because it'll be hilarious. Like, I got shot and he didn't spot anything. Hmph. <laughs> That's unfortunate. Look at these dumb heads. That must be PlayStation. No, they're Xbox. <laughs> okay. They only put one shot in? Oh, wait. He's come back. What on earth is this play? What on earth is this play, ladies and gentlemen? The world may never know. <laughs> they're, pl they're platooned. What was that? Freedom, eh? Oh, well, he's dead. I was going to say, we can take him if our friend puts a few shots into him. Our friend put no shots into him. So we don't want to take him. We'll take those guys instead. We'll also proxy spot this freedom. Which should annoy him. Hello. He doesn't want to play. I thought he was just going to sit there. If he was, I was going to farm him. Because I could shoot up into his turret. Oh, you fired. Don't mind me put a couple, sh three shots into you. Boom. boom. Tiny gun. Tiny gun. Look at this guy. Look at this dude. <laughs> Even small gun. STA, if I knew you were going to go in, I would have followed you. I hate men and friends. I can't quite find the shot on those guys. bounce that's a full health freedom still what do we do what do we do we kill the light tank and then we go after the freedom that's all we can do oh boy 
Oh boy, oh boy. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. We have to fight right here, right now. I bounced off of him. That's so bad. I literally needed to not bounce off of him. Oh, and then we took another hit. How are you still freaking finding shots on me? Ah, we got him. We got him. <laughs> we got him. Dang, that's a bad team. That was a terrible team. But, you know, I mean, we kind of predicted it. <laughs> Yay, good good player here. Drowning himself. Good player. Congratulations, you scumbag. Go back to your go back to your artillery. Oh my goodness. Hm. Well, we tried. We literally tried. I think we were the only player in, in, in that game who was actually playing the game. <laughs> Golly. Hmm. Well, interesting. Very interesting. Uh, well, uh, hmm. This guy kind of just presses W key, won the game. <laughs> yeah. All right. All right. What a shame. What a crying shame. One more tank, though. One more tank left. <clears throat> it is the... T6100. Maybe we'll be top tier this time. Or maybe we'll be fighting in tier 9s. And uh, the T1 or T10 or T6100 is definitely one of those I don't like fighting tier 10s with. Tier 9s with, sorry. I'd rather be in the regular Tiger. Because the Tiger has better mobility and a better gun. So yeah. Anywho, uh, here we go. It's got 100 mil. It's got the same 100 mil that this T44 has. So 190 pen. Um, 250 alpha, it's got a good rate of fire so pretty good stuff, pretty cool pretty cool indeed so yeah yeah, we're on port, and port does not see tier 8 we're going to be top tier, ladies and gentlemen encounter, where is encounter in port? oh, this isn't the uh, that weird rogue harbor one this is actual port, so I think it's up in B up in B2, right? around there, and those four, four, four squares 1, 2, 3, 4 hmm probably would make sense that I go there all right. No, it's not there. Oh, it's on our side of the map. All right. Well, okay. Sure. Sure. Okay them. Hmm. Assist in twenty thousand spawn damage. Oh, it's a it's a regular thing. It's some kind of daily op or something, or weekly op, which I don't do. I don't know why they made the whole op system so confusing. Like, jeez, man. You guys are so cool. <laughs> or gaming. Nice. Let's simplify everything by making it more complicated. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> it's like I already learned so much about this game. I don't need more complicated things to have to think about. But, eh. I want to go here, but our team's not going there. Our team is all lemming training down one way. So, uh, yeah. Oh, wow. He... He rammed uh, Tiger 1. That's, uh... Hmm. So, so what did we learn, guys? What did we learn? We learned that if you're in a light tank traveling at 80 kilometers an hour, you should not be ramming heavy tanks. <laughs> hmm. Oh, well, we learned that. I don't know if he learned that. He, I doubt he learned it, because... Let's be real. He probably didn't. Good job. Is that all you've got? <laughs> yeah, I just bounced off of him. Ah. 
Ow. I'm gonna fix that. <laughs> Alrighty, why? Can't you see I'm just playing the game? Which pig is it? It's the Hummel. We're so stuck here, by the way. Burn! I don't know, we tracked him. That works just as well. No, it doesn't, actually. What did I hit? That wasn't him. Oh, I hit that little thing! Well, that hurt. I can actually win this. Oh, no, not anymore. I can't. I can actually win this. These guys are dumb one and dumb two. No! <laughs> oh, my gosh. Look at this absolute potato. Oh wait, it's, it's, I thought it was one person because of how close everybody was, but it's actually the entire team. My apologies. I thought it was one person right there, but no, it's, it's everyone. <laughs> uh, world of, uh, of everybody go to the same spot on the map. <laughs> well, we, we might actually be able to win this thanks to us as we, uh, we dealt with... Well, we were spotting their tire. He took a few hits. Um, their 45 TP is now a one shot. Uh, their Leo died. Their Sturm died. Mm. This this thing, where is it? This thing took a few hits. Like, we might actually be able to win this now. But that's 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 uh, that's asking for a lot, considering this guy is sitting side on in front of a hundred tanks and isn't moving. Hmm. Well played, sir. Well played. I think I, he must know something I don't. Oh, now he's gonna get shot by the M10 because now he's pulled back out of cover. Now the M10's not paying attention. We're good. We're good. Okay. <laughs> All right. Um. Hmm. Let's uh, let's let's wrap this up and not go any further, because <laughs> uh, man, this is this was a this was a bad team. This was the definition of bad. <laughs> All right, that's gonna be it, guys. Thanks for tuning tuning in, joining us, watching uh, some some combat at tier six and seven. We hope uh, I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, slap that like button, comment, subscribe. I'll make sure to post the post game results. You'll see them. Uh, maybe right now, you see them, and so you can look at the enemy team, you can look at my team, you can be like, hey, how on earth did that happen? <laughs> uh, but that'll be it. Thanks guys for tuning in, uh, make sure you go check out Space Bennett, link in the description below, and let me know, do you like the Tigers? I hope so. I hope so. I'll be seeing you guys all later. Take care, everyone, and peace out.